Donald Trump calls King Charles a great man after bombshell cancer diagnosis Donald Trump's comments come after King Charles was diagnosed with a form of cancer. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Info Mate. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. The shock diagnosis came just days after he returned from hospital following a procedure to correct an enlarged prostate. Former U.S. President Donald has described King Charles as a wonderful man and said he will pray for a swift and full recovery after it emerged the British head of the state has been diagnosed with cancer. Trump wrote in capital letters on his Truth Social, King Charles has cancer. He is a wonderful man whom I know well during my presidency, and we all pray that he has a quick and complete recovery. This comes just days after the king smiled and waved as he finally left hospital on January 29 after a three-night stay following a procedure to correct an enlarged prostate. An isolated issue was noted during these procedures. He has now started regular treatment and his doctors have advised him to postpone his public duties, the Buckingham Palace statement said. He added that he would continue to take care of state affairs. The palace did not specify what type of cancer the king suffers from, but said it was not related to the king's recent treatment for benign prostate disease. Prince Harry has spoken to King Charles about his cancer diagnosis, and will travel to the UK to see him in the coming days. A Buckingham statement released this evening said, a separate problem case was identified during the King's recent hospital procedure for benign prostatic enlargement. Subsequent diagnostic tests identified a form of cancer. News of the royal's diagnosis comes as his daughter-in-law Kate, Princess of Wales, recovers from abdominal surgery for which she spent about two weeks in hospital. Kate is still taking a break from royal duties while recovering. Her husband, Prince William, heir to the throne, has also taken time off to care for the couple's three children but will preside over an investiture ceremony at Buckingham Palace on Thursday. The King's other son, Prince Harry, who resigned from royal duties and moved to California in 2020, is expected to fly to Britain in the coming days to see his father. Okay, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Please like, share, and subscribe for more.